point blank, uh, bikinis are scary. Summer is scary in general because body positivity is not something that people talk about enough um, and I feel like it's such an important message important for girls to feel comfortable with who they are and be able to embrace who they are without feeling forced to be a certain way and if you take anything away from this video know that I didn't want to do it um, and I'm scared to even do this but that I'm doing it because I want people to see my body know that it's not like a Kardashian body it's not sculpted or edited um, <clears throat> but it's real and it's it's who I am and you're it's okay to look not like you're photoshopped or edited and if you do look like that that's a great but it's just you know it's an open accepting space right here okay so hey guys welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel um if you don't I already know who I am. I am Milk and this is Milk Astrology. Um, <clears throat> I'm also really sick right now, so sorry that I uh, sound and look like this. I'm dying on the inside. This video is a video that I'm, I'm scared to do and I also never thought that I would do, um, but wanting to grow my channel and wanting to eventually become have my main source of income become being on youtube and being on twitter and instagram i want to start saying yes to things instead of no because for so long i feel like i have been saying no to things and turning things down Ugh. zaful uh the fashion company has been nice enough to send me some bathing suits and also two outfits or three three outfits um and i'm going to try them on and review them and just kind of show you guys um each bathing suit and each outfit and uh i never thought that i would actually do a video like this because honestly like i've struggled with my body and my image of my body and my weight for so long um i have an, a history of eating disorder i have body dysmorphia and I've struggled to the dog is licking the floor. Um I've struggled to feel confident or feel like my body is okay and even now if you guys have been following my personal life uh journey I've been going through some things with my body recently and I'm not the size or the image that I feel confident with and I am doing things to try to adopt a healthier lifestyle like i'm trying to eat healthy i'm not trying to restrict myself anymore i'm not trying to starve myself um but it took me a really long time like i'm almost 25 years old i'm 24 right now and i still don't have that body positivity that i feel is important and i feel like when people make these videos and they sell this kind of image of um being happy and thin and confident like it's not always uh like a full like a triple threat package that you're giving someone i feel like um it's important when you stand up and you like advocate bikinis or um like bikini hauls or these kinds of things like it's important at least for my brand and for what i do on my channel to tell my followers and subscribers like hey like it's cool if you don't look like a model it's cool if you feel confident as whatever size that you are and whatever shape that you are and it's not about how anyone else should make you feel you should look it's about how you want to look and that's all that matters um so yeah currently also like i'm a, always been a very curvy girl i've always been very um I feel like I was always like kind of a fuller figured kid growing up. I was never like a thin kid. I was never like a scrawny kid. Like I've always had a lot of curves and I've always was, was an early bloomer. So I've always had like a fuller chest uh, at a really young age. And my mom is Persian and my dad is white and Filipino. So like I don't have these really like natural slim european jeans like i have like, persian curves and i have um just like a different body type like i'm short and i'm curvy and so 
uh, being like 5'1 and weighing 122 pounds right now, like with this opportunity, genuinely, like I didn't want to take it. Like I was kind of like, no, like I don't feel, I've never felt confident enough in my body, even when I was like 90 pounds, even when I was 113, I was never um, confident to like stand up in front of the world in a bathing suit. And the reason why I'm doing it today is because I was only going to do it if I was able to kind of make a body positive message with what I'm doing. Like I'm not going to get up and be like, oh, look how great I am or like this is what you should look like because genuinely like I'm not happy with the way that I look. And it's not that I feel like I need to be thin to be beautiful. It's just I have body dysmorphia. It's like the way that I see myself will never be good enough and the person that I see in the mirror isn't always a reflection of what's actually in front of me and it's hard for me to differentiate that and also like at the same time we shouldn't feel like we have to look a certain way to be accepted by society but unfortunately like there are a lot of marketing ads and campaigns that make women feel like we have to be a certain way even men like everyone everyone is kind of under this pressure to be a certain image and I don't think that you should try to be or look like someone else to try to look like the best version of yourself and that doesn't have to be shrinking your body to be that way and I don't advocate like losing weight or being thin I feel like I feel like all curves are beautiful I feel like bigger girls bigger people like they're beautiful in the way they are like I don't think that anyone should alter who they are to fit into something that they aren't and that's i don't want yeah so i just don't want that message to come out but at the same time like i feel like i'm almost halfway through my 20s and i feel like it's stupid to be so insecure about my body for so long literally since i was 15 and i just feel like it's important to talk about these things because I feel like it's not really talked about. I feel like you see a YouTube video of a really thin person um, and they're smiling and they're prancing around in a bikini or something and you're like, wow, they must like have a perfect life. And even when I was thinner, I wasn't always happier. Um, actually, I think when I weighed more, like the biggest I ever weighed for myself personally, I think I was ha the happiest. Um, so it's really not about like what you look like is going to make you be happy. It's about how you like your own perception with the world. And long story short, this is a video I did not want to do. I'm genuinely scared about the reaction I'm going to get for it. Um, and I don't feel like I am the person that should be doing this job. I feel like a very skinnier, younger version of a YouTuber should be standing up here and doing this, but I also feel like I should do this because not many... I, I know when I was young, I didn't get a lot of representation. I didn't get a lot of like curvy version, strong, empowered women in the media who were kind of advocating to accept themselves because I feel like I would have accepted myself a lot sooner and a lot younger um so I don't know, I'm hoping that this is like a video where I can be like hey I'm really insecure and scared and I hope that this message can translate to someone younger than me impressionable who has like a Persian body or any it doesn't even have to be Persian just like someone who can identify or relate to me and see my body and see like that it's not perfect but that it doesn't have to be perfect um and i'll feel like i'm sending the right message without further ado <laughs> i'm so scared we're going to be doing a bikini haul with zaful and um when i first went on the website and was like looking at all of the options um I don't know, I feel like I'm at this weird age where like you can't really shop for your age. Like you have to shop like you're either still in high school or you have to shop like you're like almost in your 40s. And there's really not a lot of youthful or like t mid 20s to late 20s attire that I feel like is, um, 
I don't know, accurately depicted in fashion these days. Like, I go to Forever 21 still, and I feel like a lot of the clothes are just very... I don't know, but I'm not trying to like define what people should or shouldn't do. I just feel like for me personally, like it's hard for me to feel like I should be wearing certain things because I'm very hard on myself. Um, so I was kind of scared because this website seems very like trendy and fashionable. And also I feel like the way that a lot of the clothes looked are for girls that are probably thinner than me. And so um, trying these on, there are a lot of them that were kind of misses for me, but there was like one bathing suit that I was really pleasantly surprised that fit me and I feel like if um if anyone like goes shopping online for a bathing suit which seems very scary because bathing suits are very personal and hard and suck in general to go shopping for um but also online is like shopping blindfolded for something so personal I will say that Zaful has some good options for all sizes and I feel like you can find a bathing suit that flatters you whether you're pear-shaped, whether you're curvy, whether you're full-figured, whether you're thin or I just feel like it has a lot of range and I was surprised to see that and I'm not saying that because I'm not like just because I got these bathing suits for free doesn't mean that I am being paid to make this video like I'm not getting money right now to say that so I, I'm just saying like objectively I was surprised because I genuinely didn't think I was going to like anything and um, then I also got sent three outfits and I did pick out everything so it's my fault if I don't like something because I probably didn't shop for my body I have a very hard body to shop for like it's curvy and stubby and short so it's like I don't feel like clothes are not made for women like me I feel like they're made for like tall thin giants which not more power to you if you're like that I just feel like it's not it wasn't meant for me. Enough talking, let's try them on. But I also feel like it shows a lot of skin, which I'm not personally comfortable with. But I do like the colors, and I did choose this because of the army green that I really like. Um, this is a size medium, and because I feel like I am probably a size medium, but my if you have a big bust like I do, this is not going to be your best friend. It just doesn't feel supported. But again, it's a really pretty color and I'm not mad at it. I just personally don't feel like I'm going to ever wear it. Um, yeah. There's more support, but again, I do feel like this is a bathing suit that just is not the best i still just it's just something I, don't, I personally feel like very comfortable or confident in um but it is red and that's a good fiery color for summer like tanning at the gym in but i don't i like the way that it's cut but i just don't feel like it supports me enough like maybe i'm crazy but i just feel like i'm like it's not it's not the right size and that's again partially my fault probably but it just feels very um very i need something that's going to unconditionally support me the way my father never did so I have to do a black bathing suit because i felt like it was like a safe flattering one like everyone looks good in black but again, I just don't feel the support. Like if you can see, it's just not <laughs> supporting me enough. And again, that could be because I didn't get the right size. All of the bathing suits that I actually picked out were in medium, but um, yeah. It's just, I don't know. It's a pretty bathing suit. It kind of reminds me of like Hercules or something or something a Capricorn would wear, but just, it's a no for me. It's. I like the idea, but I just think with my body type, like I definitely got the wrong size or it just doesn't flatter me the way that I would like for it to. And that I actually really like. And I would go back and personally buy more just like this, like in different colors, if we ever go to the pool together. Cause it's just, I wish that the back had more butt. So I'm not really trying to like have my butt out like that, but it is really flattering and for women or anyone who carries weight in their um, stomach area um, like this this is kind of where I carry a lot of my weight um, I know some people are more pear-shaped but I don't know what I am I'm just like blob shaped 
personally, but this tucks it in nicely and it's just, it looks very flattering. Um, and this is a very supportive, this is approved. But yeah, this is my favorite. I really like this one. The first two piece outfits that I got and it's really cute. Um, it is like really long and so I would probably wear this with like heels um, and personally I do wish it was a little bit not as long um, because I feel like it's kind of drowning me um, it's not my most favorite outfit that I was gifted by them but I do like the color and I did pick this out I do like this top I might still use this top and then like not use this skirt so much or like use this skirt with like something different but I do like I don't know I look kind of like I'm drowning but it's fine. I look like a peasant outfit, you know? Like I'm gonna go uh, join Little House on the Prairie, if you know what I mean. So this one I actually like a lot. Um, but I feel like you need to always iron it to make it look good and you probably have to wear it with heels Because again, it's long. So if you're short like me, you're going to look like you're drowning But I do like the color a lot and I feel like it has like a very vintage kind of timeless look but again, you have to iron it and the one big perk about this outfit is that it has pockets so you can just always have something to, you know, keep your stuff in. Overall, that completes this video and please give it a thumbs up because again, I was not excited to do this i don't feel like i this is the job for me to be doing um but i did it because i feel like i don't want to be confined and i don't want to like give off the impression that my followers or subscribers should feel like they have to look a certain way to do things or wear things that they want or enjoy wearing um you make the rules for your life and that's all that matters and um yeah so i love you guys and Give me a thumbs up because this was a scary experience. I do plan on doing this video as signs as these bikinis, so stay tuned for that, and I will see you in my next video.